Hey, good morning. Hope everybody had a great uh, weekend. It is Monday. It is President's Day, and we are open. Even though you can't lock loans in, and the markets are closed, uh, we can still, um, you know, do business, take applications, pre-approvals. We've got a bunch of them over the weekend. So just give you a heads up on that. Most banks are going to be, actually all banks are closed today. So if you need any pre-approvals, just reach out. Um, just real quick here, as far as getting a, uh, you know, putting, you know, buying a house, putting less than 20% down and going conventional, this is only conventional loans, okay? There's multiple ways to structure your private mortgage insurance. Most people just think of a payment every single month and then you know once they get to two years and or 20 percent down at the same time then they can get the uh you know pmi taken off however there's multiple multiple ways you can structure there there's a way where you can roll the pmi into the loan amount okay which is a lot less of a payment than the monthly sometimes um and you know just a good rule of thumb i've, I've said this before for every thousand dollars, your payment only changes five bucks. Okay, so keep that in mind. So when you have a PMI, and let's say the PMI payment is seventy-five dollars, you know, added to your monthly payment, if you can roll that in, yeah, it's going to increase your loan balance for a short time until you start paying it down. But that could save you seventy-five dollars a month or sixty dollars a month, and so forth. Where you can apply that towards investments, apply that towards your debt, and so forth. There's there's other ways to do PMI where you can split it up, or you can do some towards your loan amount, some towards your your uh, you know payment per month. Um, and there's 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 a you know there there's a sorry I got somebody trying to cut me off here. There's like multiple ways where you can um, you know structure that. So. Uh, I'm just giving you two or three different ways. There's other ways to do it, uh, but just keep that in mind. You know, a lot of times, a lot of people want to do 20% down to avoid the PMI, and I get it, but man, if you have debt over here and you have payments over here where, you know, it's costing you five, six, seven hundred dollars a month, where well, you could apply that towards that debt, there, there's your savings right there, or you could take that money and, and apply it towards investments and so forth, okay? Hopefully that makes sense. You got any questions, comment down below, shoot me a private message or text me at 423-262-9229. Have a great day and I'll talk to everybody soon.